Hey everyone, it's Aaron from God a Minute. I believe that Jesus is coming soon. I also believe in a rapture before the tribulation, Daniel's 70th week. I don't know when that is. I hope it's soon. But uh, here we have a picture that I took from Kingdom Covenant YouTube channel, and his name is Jericho, and I'm going to put his full video from where I got this picture from in the description box below. He'll go into more detail about what I'm presenting to you here. I like to do short videos in this area on YouTube, and I also do live streams, too, and I also put things on my community wall, so make sure to understand how YouTube even works. Sometimes people don't know where the videos are. This is a shorter video in the video section, and then there's live streams somewhere else, and underneath the videos is the description box where you can find ways to support, where you can hop into Discord, where I socialize with people, Telegram links, Facebook links, um, shirts and cups, and all that kind of stuff. Um, so just really understand how YouTube works. But this picture right here is basically Christianity versus Islam. And so the top we have the, the Islam belief, and the bottom we have the Christian belief, the bottom false prophet, Antichrist, and Jesus Christ, who are waiting for the ultimate uh, Jesus the Christian Jesus to come at his second coming to be the final judge to rule and reign on his millennial uh, kingdom for 1,000 years, that it is interesting that the Islam has the opposite characters, the, the Isa, Ma, Mashi, the Mari, and the Dajjal. Now, like I said, I'm going to link the video uh, below, but I've said this before in other videos. Islam literally says there's no trinity. Islam says there's no son of God. Uh, he, you know, he's not a father. He doesn't have a son. He's only by himself, you know, one. And the Islam believes that in the end times, the whole world will convert to be Muslim. And you know that in their beliefs, they, um, you know, the extreme side of things, they behead. And they, um, so here we have the exact opposite character development uh, from our story to theirs. So just another telltale sign that the Antichrist will very likely use this um, religion to continue on for this seven-year tribulation. They believe that uh, their Mahadi will reign for seven years. So yeah, that video will be linked in the description box below. There is another video that was sent to me uh, many times, and it was by John MacArthur. And so I'm going to try and link that video as well. Um, it, I think it was about a half-hour video. And again, I don't know everything that John MacArthur believes, so, um, you know, take all that with a grain of salt. But uh, he had a pretty interesting message on how, you know, Islam is the opposite of Christianity in terms of how eschatology is all going to play out. So I believe, again, the AC will, the Antichrist will use the Islamic faith, and they're going to be deceived right to the very end, unless God works on their hearts. So, so pray for them, of course, that they know the truth. The truth is that Jesus is the Son of God, and uh, He is the way, and He is the truth, and He is the life, and He did die on the cross for our sins. They believe that He did not die on the cross for our sins. They believe that He was taken off the cross before He died, and some other guy was put up there and, and replaced Him. So, quite an interesting <laughs> way around it, but uh, we know that that's not right. And so, uh, many Christians, and we all have testimonies in our life that we know that Jesus is real. And he is about to come back. So uh, I leave you with that. And here is the picture. If you want to research more, and I'll leave those two video links. I'll, like I said, Kingdom Covenant, I'll leave that in my description box. You click the more button, and then you can find that video. That's about a half hour video. And then I'll try and link the John MacArthur video as well underneath there. And um, I can't think of any other religion that the Antichrist is going to use but this one. So um, love you guys very much. Jesus is coming very soon. I hope to see in the clouds like, now-ish like extremely soon like hopefully very very soon <laughs> and uh, until then we keep on telling people about jesus christ who died for your sins who died for the whole world for god so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whomever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life for god did not send his son into the world to condemn the world but that the world through him might be saved he who believes in him is not condemned but he who does not believe is condemned already because he has not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of God. John 3, 16 through 18. God bless, see in the clouds one day closer. Hi.